this fight here, I'm not gonna lie, I think this will probably be the biggest UK fight of this year. I'm not gassing it, I'm not overhyping this. Lyndon Arthur and Anthony Yard. The competitiveness of this fight is gonna be on another level. You think Joe Joyce and Daniel Dubois, you think Ted Cheeseman versus Sam Eggington was like one of the best fights of the year. This one, I'm not gonna lie, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm tipping my hat off to be the best UK fight of this year. bro not gonna lie fam yo guys welcome back to my video if you haven't done it already please click the subscribe button also click a like on this video if you haven't done it already it helps out a lot i have no idea how but it does if you haven't done it already as well follow me on instagram and twitch of off the canvas boxing so let's get straight into this so anthony Ad has had 21 fights of which 20 wins 19 by way of knockout um, I believe he's had one loss only against uh, Kovalev. Kovalev being, some would say, one of the all-time Hall of Fame light heavyweights of all time. He's, he's up there, like, I'm not going to lie, in terms of skill, in terms of ability. He's up there in a, at least in the top 10 light heavyweights of all time. All right, so for that fight, he, he was coming off a lot of great wins, a lot of sort of, he was clearly got opponents, put, put it this way. Um, he was offered the opportunity to fight Kovalev around the around last year or something like that, 2019 um, September time, I believe August September time in 2019. Anthony Arnold was then provided with the uh, option to then have a step aside and let Canelo fight um, Sergei Kovalev, Anthony Arnold, and then team. You know, you know why I like them? They have so much self confidence within themselves. Yeah, this is what I like them. I don't like no. Um, Oh, I don't want to swear them, but it starts with a P and it's a word and it ends with a whole term. You know, in the, in the, in, in the industry, if you get given an opportunity, fam, you've got to take it, fam, yeah? Step aside, like, like well, you're an idiot, fam, but step aside, fam. There's, there's no, fam, step aside, but what's all step aside, fam? What, what are we on, fam? Yeah? And to the other said, nah, nah, we're taking this fight, absolutely. Listen, you can offer me as much step aside as you want, we're taking this to the bank yeah big up them yeah uh, this is why i like them so much anyway coming, coming into that fight they had what well, they had things going against them the, the bookies were against them the um the the people were against them in, in russia they lost their bags but when i watched the fight it was a very 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 close encounter i'm not gonna lie like based on what i was hearing you would have thought that Sergei Kovalev would have warped the floor with anthony yard he yeah, anthony yard was about this close he was this close Dana said I'm, if I, if you don't pick it up in the night run I'm going to pull you out fam that's how deep it got yeah of course Anthony Yard went all in all out attack and you know what like on FIFA you know you got all out attack here you can see the goal in the last minute it's like come on fam it gets like that that's, that's, how, that's how sport works in the end you know you win some you lose some and on the 11th front he was unfortunately knocked out and with basically just a, a very sharp and, and very world class jab which basically in the 11th round when Antelo was fully tied you know he couldn't really get up afterwards and and you know all of that energy was 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 sort of used in the prior rounds which which was this it was this close it was this close um but yeah don't worry like this guy i'm not gonna lie he's definitely gonna come back he's gonna come back strong he beat the next couple of opponents i think it were a few warm-up fights so he beat the two next, next opponents and then he's fighting Lyndon arthur Lyndon arthur is one of the toughest opponents the light heavyweight opponents in the united kingdom listen big man i've heard a lot of good things about this guy a lot of good things about this guy behind the scenes believe me he's from manchester up north like, this guy from what I'm hearing, he would tr give Anthony Yard a lot of problems. He was uh, good friends with Bugsy Malone alongside Zelfa Barrett, Zelfa the Flash Barrett. 
and that was the first time I, I, I've ever heard it like him of course you, you know a lot of us if you don't know Bugsy Balloon it's a big man singer yeah, you get to know fam you know in a way there if you haven't heard his daily duppy what would he say girls all from Greg daily asking me if I was about in London but I was in many of Darky and Lyndon talking politics like Bill Clinton Lyndon Arthur as well has got a good record himself 17 wins um, 12 by way of knockout I believe so you know it's a very decent opponent his last fight was against Dex Spellman of course him and Anthony Yard beat Dex Spellman so um, I wouldn't really look too much into it but very very formidable opponent himself for me Anthony Yard will win this fight but this is going to be a very very tough opponent for Anthony Yard because Lyndon Arthur is no mark he's no joke very skillful as well um, so Anthony Yard has got a lot on his plate for um, Lyndon Arthur but Anthony Yard based on his ability based on his self-belief his his work rate and you know the the power and the energy that he, he has he should be able to beat um Lyndon Arthur but this is not Lyndon Arthur is no pushover and this would probably be be besides Kovalev be his toughest opponent it would be by far with Kovalev up there be his toughest opponent that he could have faced can Lyndon Arthur win if Lyndon Arthur wins I will not be shocked put it this way all right if Lyndon Arthur wins I will not be shocked I, I've seen clips of him I'll watch his, his last couple of fights I will not be shocked because he's very 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 skillful very uh, like sharp quick powerful as well you know um i got a good job as well on him as well so he's a very very formidable opponent if he wins i will not be shocked but can't wait to see this fight I, who am i supporting this is a tough one this is a tough one listen Bugsy Malone is one of my favorite rappers in the uk all right and the fact like the fact that he was rapping about people like he was rapping about people like Lyndon Arthur and etc etc in his bars that I remember off the top of my head for me it to gravitate towards that person but Anthony Yard is from the end Anthony Yard yeah it's listen Anthony Yard is from ends so I cannot like I don't know man, I, I'm, I don't know man, I don't know where my life goes as it goes man And today I try is like, guy, do you know what man, I'm back in Anthony Yard Yeah, I, I really like Lyndon Arthur, I really like him yeah And I want, well, I, if I wanted, if there was a way for both of them to win, I want both of them to win So I've got to pick one person to win, it's got to be my man Anthony A.Y. Yard Yeah, ah, he's in the camp, you know the way he did Hey, listen, as soon as I said that my hands are already going fam, my hands are, my hands are already, listen, my hands are already gone fam, my hands, listen, what are you saying fam, what fam, what, what, if you haven't done it already, please click the subscribe button, pull up, put a like on this video as well, drop a comment as well, let me know who you guys think will win, um, but peace, love and prosperity guys, and I'll catch you guys in a bit, peace.